In this exercise, we're going to have a look at how to use the Sapphire Time Average plugin. Time Average interpolates frames to generate a blended trails effect. It's most effective when using locks off shots of quickly moving traffic or crowds. So here we have a motorway traffic clip on which we're going to apply the Time Average plugin. While most Sapphire plugins are found in the MLT Effects menu, Time Average is located in the Utility application. Scroll the Off button to the Sapphire Time Collection, then select the Time Average plugin. The main parameter is Av over Frames. This determines the number of previous frames to animate over. The higher the number, the more frames that are blended. In this case, we'll leave it at the default value of 10 frames. And render the clip. In Utility, the Render button can be found in the middle of the screen, and the progress of the render is displayed in the main window. Returning to the Edit Timeline, the effect can be played. So that was the default setting of 10. If we undo the effect and return to the Utility application again, we can try a different value. Select Sapphire Time, then Time Average again, and this time increase the Av over Frames parameter to 50, which is about 2 seconds. Render the effect again, and we can see the blend spread over a greater number of frames. On returning to the edit timeline, note that the effect will not be as evident for the first couple of seconds, since there haven't been enough frames to combine, but after that, the longer blend spreads evenly across the footage. And try it with different shots. Or with crowds. Although if it is a crowd scene, speed the clip up a little, because walking pace isn't quite fast enough to get the best results.